Hello, my name is Richard. I'm with Josue, and I'm going to take Josue through a nice little LR stretch and uh, flexibility range of motion type of exercise or type of activity. Okay, good, Josue. Let's grab the suspension straps. Okay, first thing, I want you just to lean forward like so. Okay. And what I'm trying to do is instill a neutral spine in him. So I want him to draw his stomach in and squeeze his glutes. And a neutral spine is mean, means being flat, flat. He has this little curve right here, but once he works into his hips more, like so, that curvature will go away. Okay, and one thing about stretching, you know, static stretching or in stretching is good, but in, in the day you want to move because your body likes to move. So let's go back and forth, Josue, with this same stretch. And so he's still getting the same benefits, but he's moving, and that's what his body really likes to do is move. Excellent work. Okay. Just give me two more. Okay, now come up like 45 degrees right there. Okay, let's do some golf swings. Excellent. Okay, we've got 30 seconds on the clock here. And once again, he's moving. He's moving to stretch. He's teaching his muscles how to work. You know, your muscles working is just important as your muscles being stretched to improve your range of motion. And break. Okay, good. Josue, let's get some T's and Y's just to stretch the chest part out and kind of work his back muscles a little bit. So we open up his chest by going like into a T. Good, so really open up that chest. Then, no, then go give me like a Y or even close to an I, like an IY. <laughs> there you go, excellent work. Okay, we're not working him too hard, we're just trying to stretch him out a little bit. So let's do this for another 30 seconds. Alternate between T and Y. And if you want to make it harder, if you want to make it more of a workout, if you will inch yourself closer to the LR device, but if you want to make it a little bit easier and much more of a stretch, you're you'll go away from the LR interface or LR device. And break, okay, good. So let's turn around with it, Josue. Okay, and really just get into that chest and we're just gonna give him a nice little static, static stretch. Just really try to open up the spine. His, his, thoracic spine, which is the mid, the upper to the middle part of your, your spine. And in this part, you really want to have a lot of mobility. And so since we drive cars all the time or sit at a computer desk, this part of our body tends to be over curved. It has a natural curve for it, but you don't want it over curved. So we're going to try to cheat driving in the car, being at a computer desk, cheat gravity even, and just open them up a little bit. Okay, but once again, as I always say, draw your stomach in and squeeze those glutes, and that's going to get the most out of it. Okay, Josue, let's, let's keep your arms up and cheat one foot in front of the other. Okay, good. So they just pivot toward me like a little side bend. Good. So now we're stretching his lats out, but we're going to add a little bit of movement. Let's go back and forth, 30 seconds on the clock. If you, I think if you really want to get the maximum amount of stretch, just pivot that left foot just a little bit. You know, pivot the left foot as you bend to the side. There you go. Now you should feel more of a stretch in like your psoas or the front part of your hips. Do you feel that? Yep. There. And two more. Okay, switch sides. This guy is a machine. He's ready. To, he's ready to go to combat. But you know, the most one of the most important things coming back from combat is just really just kind of getting the body cooled down and prepared for tomorrow's combat. So he had a great workout earlier. So we just really want to cool his body down. You know, relax his central nervous system. And just 
you know, restore the muscles back to their original length, and at the same time trying to improve his range of motion. Okay, let's continue with working on, with stretching out the obliques in the side. So face me, and just grab one strap. Okay, so we're gonna do like that little side thing. So tight rope your feet, so right foot in front of the left, right foot in front of the left, there you go. And a nice tight rope. So that means the inside foot is in front of the, the, the outside foot. There you go. And just go side, there you go, good. I know that feels good. So it just adds a little bit of movement. So you train your muscles too at the same time. You gotta think your muscles are like, a, all, your whole muscular system is kind of like a whole bunch of rubber bands connected to each other. So one way helps you, stretching one way helps you open the other way. So that's the way you gotta treat your body, like a, like a, like a bunch of rubber bands. And so that's why movement is probably the most important thing in, in improving your range of motion, even more than just static stretching like they used to do back in the olden days. Okay, switch other side. Not, I mean, of course, static stretching still has a place, but you know, at the end of the day, you want to add movement and into your, into your stretching modules. Okay, once again, host way, cheat the left foot in front. So you want to cheat the foot closer to the wall in front. There you go. And I think you'll maximize the stretch. Yeah. There you go. Good. Just keep your hands overhead, though, so you can really get into the lats also. He, little, he has a little tightness in his shoulder right here. break. Okay, now let's just kind of work into that shoulder capsule. And you know, we're going we're gonna to do like what they call a banded distraction or have the resistant bands help stretch out his shoulder joint. So why don't you grab the two bands right here. And grab it with both hands like so. Good. And just lean forward like so. And put your left, put your left hand on top. Put your left hand close to your wrist. And it's like you're playing basketball, you're doing a finger roll. So finger roll. Good, now put your head down. Do you feel that open up the shoulder? Mm -hmm. There you go. So now we have a little static stretch, but it's still a little bit of movement because the band has a little give to it. So it's, it's just kind of like, you know, it's just inching more range of motion into that joint. So let's hang out here for a good 30 seconds. Now I recommend if you, when you go into the static stretching modules, you should do it with a band that helps you get into it a little bit deeper. And if you do, you should hold it from 30 seconds to two minutes. And change sides. Let's see, we also swear he likes to do a lot of pull-ups and a lot of rowing with the LR. So that part of his body tends to get a little bit overworked. So, you know, we're just kind of just restoring the muscles back to their original length. And you see how I'm making him scoop his hand underneath like that? So it promotes this, not your shoulders up on your ears. We don't want that. That's not the look for the summer, is it, Josue? Nope. Okay. Okay, good. So why don't we keep the strap in your right hand and face, the, face, face me? There you go. So put your right hand up in there like so. That should be a good stretch all in its own, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, so draw your stomach in and squeeze your glutes. Now let's get into the hip a little bit also. So bring the right foot back. There you go. And that's just like a mini lunge right here. Yeah, so let's, let's add a little mini lunge back and forth. Now we're adding movement back into the equation.
and change, other side. Okay, it's opened the whole body up, isn't it? Your hips and obliques do so much movement and your glutes do so much movement for your body, especially when you're playing a lot of sports, a lot of twisting, a lot of lateral and side movement. So that, that side tends to get worked a lot more. So it's really good to, you know, cool this, this part of your body down. You know, once again, restore the muscles back to their original length and help, you know, calm your nervous systems in that, in that area. Okay, good. Okay, let's grab, let's grab the suspension straps once again. Okay. Good. Let's say, let's say turn around. Okay. And let's just go back into this final pose. And now we make it really static. And it's really just cooling him down. And really just try to open that spine all the way up. There you go. Can you stick that chest out further? You just lean forward, just surrender. Surrender your heart, your chest forward. There you go. And you see how he inched his feet backwards to get more flexibility in the upper back or to, and to, to promote, get more flexibility in that upper back. There you go. Now you can do a little bit of snow angels, adding some movement back to it. Just really trying to... Break. Okay, we all set for the day. How do you feel, Josue? Good, good. Yeah, really cool down, a lot yeah. more flexible, feel good, good range. Feel more stretched out. No pain anywhere? No pain. Okay, good. And that's it for today. Take care.